This is Peggy Ann Saltz, and this is Four Minutes with Pure Wisdom from our Marketing Masters. And today we are chatting with Mark Slade, VP Brand and Managing Director, Brand Partnerships in UK, Germany, and France at Digital Turbine. Mark, to start with, give us a high level view of Digital Turbine. So Digital Turbine, the best way to describe it is a, a global advertising growth platform. First part, which is the kind of heritage of the business, which is our on-device solutions. This is where we partner with the largest telcos and handset manufacturers globally. And we offer solutions for brands to embed apps on those devices globally. So we reach about um 800 million devices. We also have our brand and advertising division. Another piece of the business is the monetization division where we have our exchange. That's the second largest exchange behind Google. So we reach about 1.2 billion users across 60,000 apps. And the final division uh, of the business is our growth platform. Attention metrics, studies, and looks at whether people are engaging with the ad uh, and effectively paying attention. So we've done studies now with Lumen uh, and Amplified Intelligence to look at how our uh, ad formats, particularly our rewarded video format, measures up when it comes to attention. Across both the vendors, uh, we're seeing over 20 seconds of attention, which is off the chart compared to a lot of the video vendors in the marketplace, sort of 10x that of social media. Users that are looking at the ad, they get engaged with the video ad itself and they stay attentive to that ad unit through the 20 and 30 second video unit. But then they get a kind of supercharge, if you like, on attention with our end card. There's a lot of preconceived views around mobile gaming in terms of audience and in terms of premium environments. What the attention data has enabled us to show is that it's actually a premium advertising environment, delivers on really core metrics like our people looking at it. There's a perception that it's just kids that are on mobile games. And frank, frankly, the, the larger demographic group is the 30 to 49 year olds. And that kind of mirrors the fact in Germany that the biggest category is your puzzle category uh, within mobile games. We saw that 52% of uh, Germans play mobile games. So the German market love games. So 42% of respondents said they remember their video ads. That's versus 28% on TV. It's interesting, it's quite ironic because the data also shows that 54% of our respondents play mobile games while watching the TV. So we get higher recall rates than TV, even though they're kind of multitasking onto TV. I think the key message is that it's an untapped area for advertisers. The amount of spend that goes in for major brands and advertisers isn't really commensurate with the amount of time spent. So there's a big opportunity here for advertisers to lean into this platform. And I think it's for us as Digital Turbine to work harder with companies like the MMA to really dispel some of these myths around the audience, get away from this perception that it's not a premium environment. We're trying to get across to the market that we have a premium ad format that delivers incredible engagement, recall and, and, and attention. And that's for us as an industry to dispel those myths. We're big, big, big fans of the MMA. We work with the MMA globally. We welcome any opportunity to share data, insights and research with the MMA that helps to build the market. There's still a lot of educating that needs to be done on our area and our platform in terms of dispelling some of these myths and changing perceptions. And we believe the MMA is at, at the center of that and will be um, very, very important in terms of changing those perceptions.